right, y'all. I'm back, honey. Now we're going to see what the peach cobbler is hitting for. Okay. Okay. Get it out the oven. It smells so good. It mm, smells real good. Cobbler, y'all. My uh, my box cake peach cobbler. So let me get me a little spatula or something and see what it's hidden for. I got some ice cream. Cream. I think if I ate that, I would want to eat that with some vanilla ice cream. But anywho, got my little bowl. So we're going to see how it tastes. And I'm going to give y'all my honest opinion. If it don't taste good, I'm going to say, nah, I got to redo it again. So I'm going to take my little. goodness y'all see it smells good too I heard it, 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 it sounds flaky mm. all right y'all we gonna see get me a fork Y'all see the scene. Y'all know it's hot. Have some. Y'all can have some. <laughs> Still hot. The oven been off, but it's just been sitting in the oven. Bustin', bustin'. Y'all know we dance something good to us, especially when we eating and we dancing. It's good, y'all. And I ain't just saying it, but it's good. I taste the hint of the little lemon. It's good, y'all. It's good. It's good. Have some. All right. Guess I'll give me some ice cream later. Well, I'm finna sit here and enjoy my little my little box peach cobbler. A little simple little box recipe. Um, get you a box of yellow cake mix. Um, get you some nutmeg. I didn't have any, but get you some nutmeg. Um, of course, peaches. I used two cans, some brown sugar, some regular sugar, um, and butter. Yeah. Oh, and some vanilla extract. Can't go wrong. I saw some people had pineapples, 
you know, you, I'm sure you could probably do this with like uh, cherries, you know, strawberry, cobbler. I'm sure it all works the same. But it's good.